in this session we will see rsa algorithm with its example first we will see the algorithm in the first step we have to choose the value of p and q which are which must be the prime number in the second step we have to calculate the value of n which is p into q in the next step we have to compute the value of 5n which is equal to p minus 1 into q minus 1 in the fourth step we have to choose a value of e which is in between 1 is less than e is less than 5n and which must be the prime number in the fifth step we have to calculate the value for the d such that d into e modulo by 5n is equal to 1 sixth step we have to choose the public key for the encryption method in the uh, seventh step we have to choose a private key which is d in comma n now let's see the example of it suppose i have chosen a prime number 3 and 11 then compute the value of n that is p into q is equal to 3 into 11 is equal to 33 then compute the value of 5n by putting the value in the formula i get 20 then i have to choose a value of e in our example the value of e lies between 1 and 20 and in between 1 and 20 7 is a prime number so i have chosen the value of e is equal to 7 you can in this step we will calculate the value of d whose modulo with 5n must be 1 in my example i have a value of e is equal to 7 and 5n is equal to 20 therefore and its modulo must be 1 therefore i will take the value of d is equal to 3 because 3 into 7 is equal to 21 and 21 modulo by 20 is equal to 1. Then we will decide the public key for our example and its formula is e comma n that means e is equal to 7 and n is equal to 33 in our example. Similarly we will declare a private key that will be d comma n d is equal to 3 and n is equal to 33. Now we will see the actual example of encryption. Suppose I want to encrypt the value of 2 here. So that I will use this formula m raised to e modulo by n. That means 2 raised to 7 modulo by 33 which is equal to 29. Therefore the encrypt value of 2 is equal to 29. Now we will find the decrypt value of c. I want to decrypt the value of 29 which is encrypted in above step. That means the formula is c raised to d modulo by n. That means 29 raised to 3 modulo by 33 which is equal to 2. So I got the decrypt value of 29 is equal to 2.